you are in the midst of rebranding, sort of like pivoting, yeah. yes. right? How does that feel like that pivoting transition? I know that it's a lot of work behind the scenes that you, you're you like, oh, I wish I can share this right now, but I can't. Yeah. How does it feel? <laughs> I, I haven't even told my siblings. I haven't told anyone other than... Um, my older brother Akif and my mm. husband mm. as the only two people who know right now and it's because I know that I'm the type of person who will just spill <laughs> <laughs> oops <laughs> <laughs> so uh, it's so exciting though because I have the AK by Atisha Khan um, Instagram account linked yep. to my phone right Right. so sometimes I like third the gun and like it goes to that account and then I'm just like ah, oh, I hate that it's dead yeah. like I hate seeing no activity there like it's all because of me as well. Mm-hmm. Like I haven't been doing anything for it, so I want to keep this going. But then now, when I see that account, I'm like, it's okay. You're good. You're gonna get like a new face, exactly. And like you're gonna be so loved, and this is gonna be great. Like it's fine. This break was needed. I'm sure it requires a lot of patience, and yeah. like <sighs> I need to relax because I want to yeah. really like you know grow yeah. this brand really well. Yeah. But yes, it's coming for mm. sure. Now. Talking about building growth in on your social media, basically yes. your audience, your community. I noticed that like you focus on building community first, mm. building audience first, and then sort of like create something for them, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. Let's talk about audience building and community building for you. Okay. Because I know that it's very important to build uh, a large audience that re- that that is a raving fan of you, mm. that is your targeted audience, not yes. just like huge audience, but like you know that they won't actually buy the things that you want to create yeah, yeah. for them, right? So, what strategies have you employed to really grow your brand and build a community around your personal brand? What strategies is honestly yeah. be consistent, right? Be consistent and. Um, I think that's the main thing When they know They can rely on you To A lot of the time When people are watching You Whether it's on TikTok On Instagram stories Instagram or um, YouTube They want to know That they can come back And there'll be something new For them Like for me as well When I watch content creators like It kind of gives me Like my own little me time And I love it And it makes my day better Right It's like some outlet to escape Correct And yeah. just like enjoy what they're watching Right Yeah And giving them that Keeps them coming back mm-hmm. Yeah Whether you realize it or not It was kind of un- unintentional But now that I realize it I'm like okay Just gotta be consistent And then We're like friends Right You wanna keep coming back Consistency mm. I it's love that Harder than it seems <laughs> Amazing How do you create Meaningful connections with that And build a relationship Behind like Community that you've built I think having Honest conversations Right That's not easy No Especially good, like a, Especially like A public figure like no, you No not, not at all I think someone I have learned from Is Emma Chamberlain You know Right yeah I know yes. She makes like She has like um, Coffee Coffee yes. brand Yes Right yeah. And I think she exited YouTube because of yeah, what she, she comes did. back every now and then But then watching her videos You realise she makes her life very raw And very, like she has honest conversations Real. And the, the random thoughts that she has in her head Like, oh, how it's like to go grocery shopping alone And coming home alone And cooking, blah, blah, blah And like how it feels like to basically Like there are small things in life That normally people don't talk about She talks about it And it makes me think like Oh yeah, that's true And it's relatable It's relatable It's and real Yeah It's kind of getting like people's words Out of their mouths And like you say it for them And I love it I love it so much like, Reminds me of you as well <laughs> <laughs> Like I think um, There are There's a reason why I like to watch certain people Because mm. I can relate to them so much right. And I love watching their content And I can Kind of use the same Not like in a copying way Not at all It's just that now I realise what I can do For my own channel as well Right This girl has done this for me And now I can do this For someone else mm-hmm. Audio Plus.